Yeah, pretty much. What's going on? Nothing, man. Chicken with you, man. Huh? You alright? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I just had a question for you, Ruby. What's up? Uh, can you talk? Yeah. Okay. Have you ever heard of? Have you ever heard of a? Uh, have you ever? <laughs> have you ever heard of a thing called um, uh, fat man's dick? Oh, that's so. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I asked you if you can tell. Yeah, yeah. I don't know why you do that. I asked you good. Can you talk? You know I'm about to say some outlandish stuff. <laughs> no, boy. My work shoes. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, said my work shoes. <laughs> oh, homeboy said my work shoes. <laughs> Daddy, did you know that because there was a piece? Oh, well, I don't know. No, it, it, it. The piece is missing. Move. You walk on that thing and you can watch it. Please, give me this. No, I don't know. Change. <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm right here. Hold the stove. Hello? Yeah, I'm back. Hey, Go man. I, I didn't mean to interrupt you. Even sound like you was all relaxed with the kids, chilling. No, I was actually bored the hell with the ass. No, sir. <laughs> I was trying to get rid of every one of them. I'm stuck with Junior still. Shit. <laughs> you said you stuck with Junior? Yeah, my pants went to shit. I got rid of the two girls. They going, they, they going to the Tequila House on the weekend because my other daughter's birthday was the other day. Oh, cool. Hey, Rita, he do want to take a match. To do something the whole weekend. When you put a bill, doing a female all girls uh, sleepover. Oh, cool. So Junior can't go. Yeah. So I called my whole girl down to see if, because she got a son, his name is Mari. Yeah. And Junior be staying at stand night over there sometime, and Mari stays over here sometimes. I was hoping. I was off for this weekend, she can get Junior. Yeah. You Ah, uh, you stuck with you stuck with Junior. Dang it, you almost got rid of all of. Now, okay, so, uh, Makita is your baby mama now, right? Well, hold on, bro. Hold on, I'm trying. What are you dragging ass, motherfucker? Hold on, I'm trying to get my phone right, bro. Hold on. <laughs> Hello? Yeah. There we go. God damn it. Okay, now. What you saying now? I said so, so this is your last your uh last baby mama that they, they picked up the girls. Okay. Oh, okay. And you're just going to drop two girls off over there. Yeah. Okay. How old did your daughter turn? You said your daughter turned. Well, how old did she turn? She turned to Sarah. Oh, cool. Okay. Cool. So they're going to be at at your baby mom. Yeah. Oh, that one. Okay. So she, okay, th that baby mama. Okay. How many kids you got with her? Two? Yeah. Okay. Two girls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. Yeah, the oldest, the oldest girl, oh, cool. Oh, it's her birthday. Cool. Oh, all right. Yeah. What about the other uh, two? The one with Lexus? Well, she with her. Oh, they staying with her too? So, oh, so all your girls are over there. Yeah. 
Oh, okay. Right. Uh, they're supposed to, I guess, they're going to go and stay the night over the ski house whenever they get, come back tomorrow night. Oh, okay. Uh, oh. Tomorrow day, whatever. I don't know how the sons are going to do it. Shit. Oh. <laughs> 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 you at the liquor store? Oh. What gas station you at back home? Speaker, Ruben. You ain't got me on speaker. All the women in the store pull your pussy out. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, <laughs> hey, lady. Hey, woman. I said you had a hit. Oh, yeah, get up, man. She ain't thinking about your man. <laughs> hey, mama. Why? Hey, sugar. <laughs> 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 oh, shit. Oh, snap. You still got me on speakerphone? You in the store still? <laughs> All the sex ladies in the gas station tonight. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> this is Ronnie James. Man, this nigga is gay, man. You ain't know. Crazy man. Oh Wait, Lord. Oh boy, you got your gas yet? Oh boy. Hey, so I was calling because I was I was wondering. It's a thing called Fat Man's Dick, mm-hmm. and this is why I'm really trying to lose weight. Fat Man's Dick. Now listen, that's the street lingo for it, but the medical term is called something else. I saw it on Doctor Oz. It was either Doctor Oz. It was Doctor Oz. Doctor Oz. You know Doctor Oz, right? Oh, okay. Huh? You don't know who Doctor Oz is? Dr. Oz, the TV show, come on, it's like this dude's a real physical doctor, and he talks about if you have certain ailments that's going on with you, you know what I'm saying? He'll explain what it is. He's been on for like maybe 10, 15 years. He's been on for a long time on CBS, but it's a talk show. But anyway. Yeah, so anyway, it's this thing where you know when you gain weight, right? Stretch your dick. You got no dick left. Yeah, do you know? Hey, did you know that when you gain weight and you get a gut, your dick curl up inside your body? Your dick, you got dick, you got. It's for real, man. I I did the test. Go, you gain some weight, nigga. Go in the bathroom and spread your legs, right? And then reach up in your dick and you'll feel it's more dick there. It's stuffed up in the fat. 
Seriously though, yeah. when you lose, did, did you know that when you lose weight, you like say every like fifteen pounds you lose, you gain a uh, inch of dick back because <laughs> it's in the fat. As your stomach comes out, your dick goes, your testosterone and your nuts and stuff go back in. Go. No, seriously. You ain't, you don't have as much penis as you would have. Like you said, I wouldn't have as much penis as I would have. No, that's the medical way. <laughs> Deep into this shit, like, dang. Go look at your, if you were to take a pic. I gotta go to my dick. <laughs> I kinda know what the fuck my dick is like. This thing. No, take this out. No, it's sick. No, it's real, Ruben. I'm telling you, I noticed it too. I know, no, I seriously, I noticed it too. And guess what? I talked to my doctor about it. My doctor did say that you, when you lose weight, your uh, your scrotum, your penis, it, your your penis comes out more. Like more of it comes out because it's now it's the gut sucked up dingling. <laughs> I know I'm making it sound funny, but it's actually some real shit. You know, it ain't nothing I ain't heard before. So go, you know, go. Your dingling ain't as big as it was when you was like twenty pounds of, of, of thirty pounds lighter. You might have lost mighter, like by you gaining that weight, you might have lost probably about a good inch of dick, inch or two inches of dick. Good inch of dick. <laughs> <laughs> Ruben, listen to me. Well, I'm listening. I know you are a vaginal connoisseur. You enjoy. <laughs> Just like the next man, but you are a um, aficionado of. <laughs> So, so, vaginality and motherfucking, you know, this nigga just coming out with some shit. What's going on, man? What's going on, folks? Where you at on Ivy Lane? Uh, Columbia. The little corner store right here on the end of Columbia and Brooklyn. Oh, you over there by my old hood. Over my, over by my old house. Where you be at? Oh, okay, you over yeah. in the old stomping ground. Yeah. Hey man, so yeah, I don't know. I I just figured you probably would want to know that because you know I, I know you enjoy. Yeah, we've been talking about well, me and you have it, but yeah, that's that's that that, we, that that shit I already known. That's over here, man. That shit I already been talking about. It. You didn't know? I didn't know that. Yeah, that shit does. Your stomach suck up your dingling. That's why women don't want to bang no fat dude because they, hey. That's why not too many chicks want to bang fat dudes because they feel like he ain't got no dingling. Oh, you know why? And that's why Ron, that's why Ron Jeremy, you, you know who Ron Jeremy is, right? The porn dude? Big, the big, fat, ugly white man be banging all the bad chicks. That's why he was such a novelty in the in the porno game because he was this fat dude with a big dingling. So usually, usually fat dudes don't have big dingling. And that's why he was such a, ooh, look, this fat man got a big dingling. <laughs> Watch your James Bond. Listen. <laughs> See, and it, 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 you know, I can understand when you say some people, but you trying to insinuate all fat people. No, that's the. What was the case, Chuck? I just fucked last night. I had this motherfucker hotly. <laughs> so, you know, I'm, you know I'm, I'm trying not to, you know, some people got it, dog, and just, some people just don't. Shit, that's life. It, you know, 
everybody's not fortunate. You got some people that just aren't there, you know? It ain't got nothing to do with the stomach fat. You know, it was just born retarded. You, you got a little dick, then you got a little dick, you know? No, no, no. It's not, it's, it's, it's not the fact of having a little dick. It's just that you could no, have you more. Know what you're saying, yeah. But what I'm trying to tell you, I ain't lost that. Chuck, I see my dick every day. Yeah, but you don't know how much dick you had when you were skinny. <laughs> You know about you seen my dick before? No, nigga. No, really. I'm trying to tell your ass. I know my goddamn dick. No, you know what? No, that one time we was, we, we, uh, we was over by the mall and we was taking a leak. And I just happened to glance over. I ain't even look at it. And that, but that's when I got I got mad at you. I wanted to punch a nigga in the back of the head. That's why I, I, I got you know no homo man. I gotta give you your props, dog. I was like, we better not. Ruben better not never bang one of my chicks. I'm, uh, but she gone. She gone if, if Ruben get a hold to her. That nigga gone. Let me tell you something. That nigga, <laughs> I know, nigga. If you get a hold of one of my women, nigga, it's a wrap. That bitch gone. That bitch, no, you good. That nigga that ruined you. I don't want you no more. Going back to Ruby. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I don't even know why I'm No homo, man. Hey, ain't no gay bone. It's not a gay bone in my body, man, but I want to punch you in the back of the head, nigga. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> my shit extended longer That's some sad shit. This is sad. Just sad. <laughs> I was like, man, fuck Ruby, man. Big ass dick, nigga. Fuck that nigga. <laughs> I know, man, but <laughs> I just, I just, I just, I just, I just, I just, I, I just found this thing on online, and uh, not online, but I found that video with Dr. Oz talking about that. I just thought it'd be funny to see what you would think about that. I don't, I don't believe that shit for everybody. No. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I'm sorry. That's why. That's why I want to get my my size down. But the thing about it is, it's not about just you know making your dick big because you think you don't have enough dingling. It's that when you want to, you know, if you could, Ruben, if you could, when you want to get them, like maybe say for instance you lost some weight, when you want to get like two inches, if you could back, if you if you think you lost some, yeah. I mean, even 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 if you straight now, like you just said, you was. You know, you had some girl hollering last night. You I'm had some lady hollering. I'm going to give you a fair metaphor on mine. Where I'm coming from. Mm. The only thing that I see women as far as my situation, mm. my stomach is in the way why I can't thrust the way I want to. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to get my down. I'm going to be in the thrust. See, like if I get it flat, mm. then I can put the whole pole in it. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I got an oval here, and she got a little oval. It's causing me some distance now. I can't, you know. You can't get all you want to give. Yeah, I'm going to give it. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, it's funny that I I was talking to this girl. This is my home girl. She's a big girl, but she don't mess with nothing but skinny. But you know, she's like, I only mess with skinny dudes. She's like, I try to do a big dude. She's like, I'll probably make one like my boyfriend, but if I want to get pounded, 
if I want that good pound, then I need to find me a skinny nigga because, you know, she's like, when I be with a... Uh, you know the only way to get up in there. Yeah, that's what she said. <laughs> So check this out. Another question, right? Say, for instance, like you get, say, for instance, you get, like, like you know, we all gain some weight, right? Yeah. What if uh, you go to the doctor and the doctor be like, listen, listen, you know, be like, you know, you can, everything is good, but she's like, your blood work, your circulation ain't right. You know what I'm saying? But you'll, you know, you, you know, she'd be like, you know, uh, you don't have any heart problems yet, but we just have a little circulation of your blood, you know, because of the weight. She's like, but well, I'm telling you now, if you keep gaining weight, your dick ain't gonna work no more. What would you do? <laughs> chuck, chuck. What would okay. you do? What would you do? Oh, on mm. Men are gonna go through that anyway, Chuck. Mm. You do know that, right? Yeah, but I'm just. Uh, this is just a hypothetical question. You being serious? I'm just saying, like, what if she be like, oh, if you work out and lose 15 pounds, your your shit be straight. You be back normal. Hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm, I'm just being honest. You think I'm. I know you would. I know you would as much as you enjoy fucking. I know you would. Yeah, I know. I'm just being honest. You think I'm. <laughs> if my mama put it right, right now, if she was the goddamn say the whole house is on motherfucking diet, mm. I'm all for it. So. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Get this meat now, cause when I get to this house, there's gonna be no meat in the house. You know. Big yeah. Ruben like the yeah. Big Ruben like to eat. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh really? Oh really? Okay. Oh, I know that. Okay. 
people eat meat like that. You know I will what say mean? that. I will say your dad does you look know? good. Yeah, that's why your dad looks so good. Like he, he, he never really been a big guy, like fat. Yeah, you know He's always kind of always stays in shape. You ain't gonna see my dad with a burger too tough, mm -hmm. especially. Mm -mm. Yeah, they, uh -huh. they don't like meat like they don't eat. You know, he eats meat, but he don't like too much of it. Too much you know of it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Started drinking sodas after he retired, Chuck. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. Mm. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, he was a juice man. Yeah. Yeah, I never really remember. What What did he used to wear? When, what, didn't he wear jeans when, 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 me, when we was in middle school? We used to play basketball. Call? What would he wear? Yeah. Shit, like, yeah, yeah, he was with, with yeah. Uniform pants, yeah. You know he didn't wear no jeans and shit. Man, that man went on the shopping spree after he retired. He went to some jeans. Levi's, nigga. Uh, I, I, go, I go pull out some pull, pull, pull the closet right now, Chuck. He even got dicky jackets in that motherfucker. Oh, go ahead. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? He, he just started this uh -huh. right after he retired. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Nah, he, he, again, he ain't drank sodas like that every time we saw my dad, Chuck. Yeah. And you know what I'm saying? Nights you stayed nights over here. We always saw him drinking orange juice. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He loved him some orange juice. He still do to this day. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, he, he, this nigga drinking Pepsi now. Mm -hmm. Like, he drinking orange juice. Yeah. He, he drinking orange juice every day. Everybody dinner time, he drinking the Pepsi. Mm -hmm. I said, wow, look at this shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. When did this shit happen, you know? He wanna start living a little bit, I guess, you know. Yeah. I, I think that's what it is. Yeah. I mean everything changes. I mean like I said, my dad ain't never seen the one of those sneakers, bro. Mm. Mm. You always see the one some old dress shoes to go to the store and shit and come back. <laughs> <laughs> you know, always dress shoes. That was just his swag. Yeah. And the only one I wanna see is what I got going. Mm. Mm -hmm. Casual shirt and got goddamn dress shoes. You go goddamn go where he going and come back. You see him play ball in the bitch. Like, Look at this bullshit here. You might hit some mm. heels, nigga. Mm. You know I mean? He ain't never wore no sneakers. Never. Yeah, I remember sometimes he'd be out there in his work boots right there. He'd be out there in his work exactly. boots playing ball with exactly. us. Yeah. Like, how you play basketball exactly. with Yeah. Yeah, that too. Yeah. Mm. But now he got sneakers. He got one or two pound sneakers in there, dude. They, they all in love. What? Yeah, I'm telling you. We're going to get... we chase up his whole game. Mm. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, man. He was a good worker. Your dad was good. Your dad was a good working bill paying man. My, my, you know what my daddy told me? What? See, my mom, mm -hmm. she retired just like he retired, right? Yeah. But she got to keep doing something. She can't stop. She can't sit there. 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 Yeah, well, I, I heard about that. We go shopping with people and stuff. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. But anyway, my daddy say, oh, oh, oh. Hey, who, he was telling me and somebody else about it. He say, yeah, my wife act like she don't know what she want to do. She can't, she can't just sit down. She, she got to keep doing something. Yeah. 
daddy say, you know, I ain't going to goddamn keep working for them damn crackers. I gave him 35 years. <laughs> 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 he said, y'all, she got no money. said, he ain't doing nothing. He's done. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we was saying he done. He done. I don't blame him. We was saying he. <laughs> he ain't with that man. Yeah, but the whole the whole thing about the whole fat man dingling thing is, um, it's not that you want to like say for instance, like say for instance, you said that you good, you know, you straight the way you are. But it's almost like buying a Lamborghini, right? You buy a Lamborghini, that's going to turn heads regardless it's a Lamborghini. But if you put some rims on it, it's just, it's going to add a little bit, you know, just a little bit more spark. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's already, you're already cool like you are, but if you can get a couple of inches to put off in them, (laughs) as you would say. I mean, if it's... If it, if it bothers you like that, Chuck, okay. No, it don't. No, it's not. It's not. It's not bothering me. I just want to ask your opinion on it. That's all. I just I thought. Going with that for some people, mm-hmm. I don't think that's everybody because everybody belly is not like that. Everybody mm-hmm. body works different, Chuck. Yeah, I mean, it's not a. It's not a. It's not a. It's not a in in the a solid thing like where it's. Set in stone, like you know. Apparently, uh, you know, you went. Apparently, you and Ron Jeremy are good. Y'all ain't got to worry about that if y'all get big. But I'm just saying, some dudes out there that if they gain a certain amount of weight, they dick me and they lose some dingling. That's what I'm saying mm-hmm. to you. Yeah. I could go along with that for some people. Yeah. You know what Especially you, especially you, you enjoy your dingling. (laughs) 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 Obviously, how many kids you got? Exactly, of course. (laughs) I just keep living until I die. You know, I can't fuck no more. It don't matter. I left my mark on the world. I need all the fucking I want to do. She might be younger than me. When I was young and tall, I was climbing through the windows and shit. <laughs> but, yeah, but you got it. If you... If you t- Ruben, if you, if you tell your boys you was climbing through windows, you gotta tell them why, that they that the, that the girls wanted you to climb through the windows. That you ain't just climb through windows. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Who's that one girl you said? Who's that? Who's that one girl that, that wanted you to climb through a window? Who's that one girl you said? Who you messed with? I know you was messing with a couple of them one like that, right? You had to sneak in back in the day. Uh, uh, but, but Melinda tried to get 
tried to get in the class to the women, I wouldn't do it. Jamor did. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, that was Jamor. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 I got tired of listening to her out there rubbing ice on her body every time she got horny and shit. I'm yeah. gonna, but what the fuck is that doing for me to listen to you take a shower and got that rub ice on yourself? That's not okay, my dick hard, but what are you doing to <laughs> Yeah. 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 Belinda got there, I put up, put Jamor up on her. They made yeah. with all that shit. She's yeah. available. Uh-huh. And Jamor was like, you see it? I said, hell yeah, you want to holler, holler, get her, man. So I said, yeah. I gave him those. Yeah, I yeah. Gave, him to, gave him to him. Mm-hmm. You know? Mm-hmm. I ain't like, I ain't like no, you know what I'm saying? See, Jamor ain't never did that for me. He won't give me no hoe. Yeah, yeah. You know, I, I gave him a whole hoe. Here you go, bro. You know? He don't call a whole hoe just for you. Huh? Jamor ain't never did that for me. You got him a whole ho? I gave him a whole ho. I don't shit no more, bro. Oh. You know what I'm saying? He a whole ho. <laughs> <laughs> you know a whole ho. Not a, not a half a ho, a whole ho. <laughs> Yeah. Cause she a hoe. That's what hoes do. Hoes do exactly. You can, you can trade them. You can buy and trade them like baseball cards. Yeah. Did it bother her? <laughs> she just wanted some dick. So Jamar, he needs some free pussy. A ho, ho. You, you, you can push out to the limits, goddamn. You know what I'm saying? She's a hoe. She can take it. <laughs> you know what I'm she can take it. Born and bred, huh? Oh, oh. <laughs> hey. <laughs> oh, man. But who are the girls that you did climb through? You had to climb through that window. Oh, that's back when you, that, that's back when Val was staying with her mama? Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. I climbed through her window. Mm-hmm. And then, then one time she came around here, so my mama went to work. My mom and dad, that was that time I got caught. Yeah, man, I got caught naked. My I remember that. Home. I remember that. Yeah. Yeah. And then we got caught in the house naked and shit. Uh. And my mama, my mama ain't seen my nigga so long. Like, damn, she tried to fuck me in, fuck around, and oh, I was in the room and I'm pulling out, and she seen my shit, and was like, oh, my lips. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 Let me talk to y'all. Uh. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying. So, so you're. Know, my- so your mama caught you in mid pull out. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but girl, I know you did. When I pulled the nigga out, I, I, I went for sure. Cause I heard something, but I, I ain't think, you know, so I'm like, man, did I just hear something? Mm-hmm. But I did it. It was too late. She was open the door, but I'm pulling out. Yeah. And I, down and behold, she seen it. So, well, it ain't a secret no more. Goddamn, she see all my business. You know what I'm saying? So, a little boy done grew up. A little boy done grew up. The first first thing she did was look down and then look up. And she was like, oh, my lips. Y'all put y'all clothes on and get dressed. Somebody here sit in the center's living room from the top. Your mama said, your mama said, my baby boy done grew up. And, and then, then, she took it upon herself to tell my daddy. That was the last thing I was hoping she was going to do. Mm. But my dad, my dad didn't trip. Mm. He didn't trip because of, I was fucking. Mm. He didn't trip about that. Mm. What he was, what he tripped about was, he say, that ain't something we all tried before. He said, I'm not pitching fuss about that. He said, I'm pitching fuss about you disrespecting the house. And then the second thing is, your mama told me you ain't even have a car no more. Oh, you did? In order for her, I didn't. Oh, wow. In order, in order for her to know that much, that means she, like I said, she looked down first and noticed. 
You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Wow, that's yeah. So so my dad was like, you know, I ain't I ain't fussing at you. You know, that we we all knew that was coming. It ain't nothing to I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not mm-hmm. about that. He said, number one, son, why didn't you use a condom? Yeah. Don't you know there's stuff out here that stick to you for the rest of your life and kill you, somebody? Yeah. You know, he, he was drilling me on that, and then mm-hmm. not to disrespect the house. Yeah. But yeah. The, the fucking part, he didn't worry about the fucking part because he knew it was coming. Mm-hmm. He, was a, he was my age one time, he told me, you know? Yeah. He say, he say out there, hey, I got it. It's a boy. I was born with it. I got a lot of will use it, you know? Yeah. Hey, you mm. know, he wasn't fussing about that. You know, he was just fussing about the disrespect and not using a condom. Yeah, yeah. Crazy. So then, if, as I was thinking, and then I also thought about, if I had to use a condom, and my mama saw the condom, you know, they ain't going to fuss about it. But he had to fuss about is the house. Yeah, this big house. Which that, that was still little or nothing, cause he said it out of his own mouth. Yeah. It ain't something he ain't never tried before. Mm-hmm. So, like, and plus he knew you was a teenager, where else you gonna take it? You had no money for the hotel. Yeah. You know, exactly. Yeah. Um, so, uh, huh? um, do you remember, uh, me, you, Tony, Jamor, who's all in my car? Do you remember Shakina? Shakina. That sounds familiar. How she look? Sh- Shakina. Shakina. She light skinned. She was the one from Georgia. Remember, she was walking. All y'all was in the car with me. Jamal was talking about that shit. I did it. Jamal said, that's goddamn root pool. The root pool one just by goddamn. He did. The way he, he said, the way I did it was so smooth. Because she was walking. Yeah. And I pulled up alongside her. All y'all was in the car. Tony Jenkins, mm-hmm. me, you, Jamar was in the car. Yeah. And, and she was walking. Motherfucker was crying as fuck. And yeah. I pulled up. And she was walking up Raleigh, man. We was down here by Cozart. I think I remember that. Going, I think I do remember she that. Had, she, was, she, was, she stayed right there at Timberleaf. Did you had the Chevy? You had the Chevy? You had the Chevy? Yeah. You want the bowl? Yeah. yeah. And she was walking in there. And I'm holding up traffic and shit, trying to get her. And she, and she came to the car. She gave me a phone number and everything. Yeah. And goddamn, I didn't call her while I was with y'all. I went until after I got through hanging with y'all. Called her that night. And next thing you know, Tony Jenkins was hollering at, uh, at um, who that was? Her sister? Not her sister. I think I remember that. I remember that. That was her. Uh, damn, I'm trying to think. Was that her friend? Was that her? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me try to get this shit straight. It was so long ago. Her name, the girl who Tony was hot in it, her name was Toya. Yeah, I think I remember that. Y'all used to go over their house, didn't you? Yeah. I think I remember that. I remember that shit. Yeah. Y'all used to go over their house. Yeah, I, I, I stuck in their window. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. The, you know what I'm saying? Her mom, mom and them were gone, and the way, the way the apartments is, the windows is like to the floor, to like to, to go to the ground. Yeah. So I, I went in, you know what I'm saying? She had, Slid the window up. Yeah. She didn't want her neighbors to see me to come in, coming in through the front door. Yeah. Through by, by the stairwell. In. Yeah. So she opened up the back, the back window, and I was climbing through the window. Oh wow! Fuck. And her mama came home, and I was back out the window. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Yo. It lived over in Timberley. Yeah. I remember that. I remember that. I remember that. Yeah. I do remember that. You and Tony used to go over there. Yep, I used, to, mm-hmm. I used to go pick up Tony. Yep. <laughs> we used to go over there to their house and shit. Yep, I remember that. Y'all used to hang out over there. So. One time, um, Tony went to Georgia with them. She wanted, talk, Shakina wanted me to go, but I ain't go because I, you know, I ain't want to, I ain't had no money. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, and, and I ain't want to go. I was uncomfortable, you know what I mean? Yeah, going out of money, yeah. I, yeah. Especially that far out. Yeah, man. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But Tony went. Mm-hmm. And that's when Shakina was telling me, she had, this one, this why me and Tony stopped hanging. Mm-hmm. Shakina told me that Tony had tried her. Oh, really? Even he, yeah, Tony, Tony Dickens tried her. I ain't know that. He tried her, yeah. See, I, that because, <laughs> that, you never wonder why me and Tony stopped hanging? I thought, I, I, I thought it was over that car accident y'all had. No, no, oh. he had nothing to do with the car accident. Mm. Me, me, me and Tony were still cool. 
Mm-hmm. That's oh. no car accident. Okay. I just I just stopped riding him like that because he sued my my car insurance. Yeah, that's what I thought y'all fell out. No, well, we didn't fall out. Like, no. Mm-hmm. I mean, you know what I'm saying? I can't remember if he broke his nose. I remember that. I remember he broke his nose. Yeah. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. Cause that made your, you know what I'm yeah, that made your insurance go up. Yeah, mm. you know what I'm saying. You ain't sued the motherfuckers we had the accident with. Mm. You sued me. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Mm. So that's why you know what I'm saying it got to the point where I'm like, oh hell no, I can't ride him no more. You still were cool. Yeah, yeah. Mm. You know. And I was the one told you Tony worked for the city. Um, for the city, remember he worked at um, Parks and Recreation. Yeah, I know and you told me. I think he had told me on Facebook. He said he, yeah, that he worked with you. I, 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 I saw I saw Tony down there every day. Yeah. Me and Tony was still all right. Mm-hmm. I just can't ride that motherfucker, you know. So that's why y'all fell out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because that's why y'all fell out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah.
Oh, yeah, yeah. I remember that. Mm-hmm. Man, that's crazy. That's crazy. No. Out of everybody I've ever hung with, and I and up that's in our age range, you have always been my best friend, and I consider you more as a bro mm-hmm. to this day. I've I've gonna you know say me, me and you we have our dis we had our different disagreements. Yeah. And, and I've confronted you on certain shit, or whatever. Mm-hmm. You know, but you've never you've never necessarily crossed me. Mm-hmm. Not necessarily. You never necessarily crossed me, and I never crossed you. Yeah. I appreciate that, Ruben. No, I'm just being honest. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I uh, I see you, you like did, I see you like you a brother. Did, hmm? You did try to holler at Michelle one time, but that was after I, that was after me. Ruben, no, I did, did not, Ruben. Ruben. I did, you did, man. When? Stop, Chuck. Ruben, I would never do that. Who told you that? Chuck. Ruben, Stop. I would never do something like that, Ruben. Yeah, you, you did that, bro. You did it. You what? did it. I don't even remember doing anything like that. What did I, I do with that? You don't. That's why I say it's all good. What did I do? How did I come at her? No, 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 no. You was you was trying to holler at Michelle at one, at one time. And Jamal was like, hey man, what you doing? You know what I'm saying? And I don't I guess somewhere in that range with Michelle was like, you know what, we're wrong for this, we better stop. But at that time, it didn't matter. The love for her had to go, on, bro. That shit, that's what I say. They ain't never hold that against you, man. I tried to holler at Michelle. Yeah, man. It's been years now. Oh, wow. But, so, <laughs> so, you mean to tell me you and Michelle ain't, ain't go out on, on a date or something? Think I don't remember. I'm trying to, I don't remember taking Michelle out nowhere. We ain't nowhere. I don't think we did, did we? Yes, you did, Chuck. I don't. Be, I, I'm being honest, Ruben. I don't remember taking Michelle out. We, where did we go? I don't know where y'all went. All, the, all I'm saying I is, that. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't stress about it because, like I say, Michelle had already moved on anyway, and I had to move on, so it didn't matter. How did me and she? Me and Michelle went on the date. I don't, I don't know how y'all went. No, I'm being up. I, I don't know all that. But it got back to me. Y'all, you know, y'all went on a date or whatever. We went on a date. You know, me and Michelle going on a date. I don't, I don't know if it was a, a, a date like that. But they saw when y'all were getting a little close and they intervened and said something to y'all. Whoever it was. Was that before y'all got together? No, this was after. This was years after, bro. I'm being serious. If I really, I'm being, if, if I if I did it, I definitely would admit to it. But Chuck, I, Chuck, huh? this, this, one, this, this one I'm trying to tell you, Chuck. How long have you been in Cali, bro? Whew, about 12 years. Damn, 12 years? 10, yeah, 12 about years. 12 years, right? Yeah. Well, this, this year, about 15, 16 years ago, Chuck. This shit is old, bro. It's Did me and Michelle old. go out to the... Remember, that's why I say the shit old. Don't worry about it. We good. I ain't never get mad with you about that. I, Cause I, I questioned you about it, and you ain't give me a straight up answer. So I left it alone. I didn't. No, me and Michelle know. went out. I don't remember taking her out. Where did we go? Where did they say we went? Chuck, Chuck, Chuck. What? Chuck, I don't know. I don't know. We went to dinner or something. Did she have a? Did she have a kid at the time? Did she have any kids? Yeah, she had kids. That's why I said that she's so old. So she had Cameron and the other uh, girl. Yeah. How old were they? How old were they? Were they? Sure, I don't remember. Sure. She got four kids. Oh, um, did she have? This, this is when she had the first two. What that dude? So he was, he, he was, I remember he went to jail. And, and I 
I want who to so so Jamor. So you said Jamor. Me and me and Michelle got real close. I, I, I say, listen. I can't remember who it was. Told me. I don't remember if it was Jamor and Jessica. Oh, who I don't remember. But it was brought to me that you and Michelle was getting close, a little too close. And they, they, I can't remember who it was, but they intervened and said something. I don't know if they said something to Michelle and you, or if they said it's just to you. And they were like saying something in this nature about, like, man, what you think you're doing, you know? You know what I'm saying? That's messed up, whatever it is. And after that, y'all kind of like distanced yourselves from each other. Hmm. Wow, Ruben. I, that's awful. If I did do that, I apologize, man. I read on the No, you good. You good. Chuck, 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 Listen. Listen. I never. That's some fucked up ass shit. I never felt no kind of way about it. No, because you had, you had feelings for her. If I did some, damn, I'm a grimy nigga. No, you know. I don't even remember. I read really on, I read really on, you remember that. Chuck, huh? Chuck, Chuck. Hey, I don't be honest with you. Mm-hmm. Why would you? Why would you prefer that? <laughs> mm -hmm. No, but that that was your that was your heart. Your... Yeah, but see, that was that was back then in high school type shit, bro. Come on, come on. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When they brought it back, so I was never mad with you. I did ask you about it to see if you were gonna tell me. You wouldn't give me a straight up answer, so that pretty much answered it for me. So I didn't, I didn't bring it up to you no more after that. That's fucked I up. That's I never fucked up brought it shit. up to you again because you, you, you know, what I'm saying I, I, I didn't want you to feel like I was upset with you, so I left it alone. I left it alone. Cause you, you're my best friend, bro. I ain't finna got damn crush our friendship over that. What's up, man? No, I see me this No, no, no. Go hey, hey, Ruben Jr. You don't hear me? Yeah. I got meet little man. Oh. I'm trying to think. Where did we? Where did? How did I? How did I do that? How old were we? How old were we? Do you remember? It's almost about 20 years ago, dog. How the, how the fuck? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you trying to goddamn pinpoint the shit. Bitch, I can't. If I had a year, I'd give a year. If I had it, I don't know what year that was. That been so long ago, dog. Did we go to the movies or something? I was, I think, I think so. I think y'all need to go to the I, every time I think about the movies, I feel like you was always there with us when we, Michelle. Nah, uh, nah, I wasn't always there. Nah, I wasn't always there. Now. That's why I say it, 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 it wasn't that serious, bro. You know what I'm saying? I just yeah, it must again, not be. I don't even remember that shit. I know. <laughs> I had you body at one time, dog. You kind of like ignored it, so I left it alone. I hold I up. Like, I hold up. Like huh? I hold up. I couldn't even be a man about the shit. What kind of man was I? I don't know. I don't know what a man with you about that. I would, yeah, I would. Yeah, that's a violation. You should. I would, I would, I would never, I would never, I would never you. You should have beat my, yeah. So yeah, now you want to make me feel guilty about the shit I don't even remember now. <laughs> that was why you ain't beat my ass. You should whoop my ass. For what? But violate, man. That's disrespectful, man. You should whoop. Wait, 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 wait. Chill, chill. What? Also, I don't My ex-girlfriend ain't got no kids with. 
Some of them got there, got kids with a bum in prison. I ain't tried him. I tried, I tried my best friend. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Are you, <is> you crazy? <laughs> I, would, I, would, I wouldn't go to them trying to fight you, bro. Oh, boy. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, I remember I remember you, I remember you used to spend, I remember I remember you used to spend the night when we were kids, you spend the night you used to, you used to, when we was kids, you spend the night and stuff, we played video games and shit all night. Yeah, you know, Chipping and talking about chicks. Why would I do that? Wait a minute, come on, man. The only way I fight you up. I'm not I'm not gonna fight you right now. If you ain't touch me, you know. That's cold, brother. 